Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Kelvin Johnson. In this video, I'll be showing you how to disable a computer in Active Directory using PowerShell script. So let's say you are working as an IT system administrator or IT help desk admin and you want to disable a device using PowerShell script and at this moment I'm using actually one computer you can see this is actually my domain controller but let's say you are actually using your Windows 10 or Windows 11 device to actually manage Active Directory or manage a server so you can actually start PowerShell from your Windows 11 or Windows 10 device which of course you should make sure that you have you should be in a same domain environment so I'm going to use the following um, command to actually disable uh, Windows 10 or Windows 11 device or you want to disable any um, Windows uh, computer in your active directory so what I'm, I'm going to do you're going to use the following command so we're going to use the get the get command let me see the get a day computer so when I enter the get a day computer you can see then I'm going to enter the following identity so we want to enter the identity which means which is, what is the name what is the host name of that device so we're going to actually let me let me try to disable those dividers the to windows 10 and dividers the windows 10 zero one and then i'm going to enter just enter disable at the account so by entering the following you can see when i just let me just run this command you can see I'm not receiving any error message so here you can at this moment we are not seeing that this device is disabled so but when I do a refresh you can see that this device is now disabled if I right click I can actually enable this account but we can also use the partial script also to actually enable the account so what you need to do is to change this disable just change this to enable and when I do when I run the script again you can see I'm not receiving any error message so let me just try to refresh this and now you can see our um, device has been enabled so when i right click i have the option to actually disable this account so you can actually do this manually but i'm just showing you the option you have with powershell script to actually disable this is actually to disable just one account if you want to disable multiple accounts i'm going to show you in a different video how to disable actually multiple um devices or multiple uh, windows devices in your inactive directory Thank you very much for taking your time to watch this video. My name is Kelvin Johnson and please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more IT videos. If you have any question concerning Windows Server, Windows, or Windows 10, Microsoft Office 365, you can always send me a personal email or you can leave a comment in the comment section of this video. Or you can also browse to my website which is Kelv global.com and they'll also also put a lot of information on how to resolve some specific IT issues thank you very much for taking your time to watch this video and please don't forget once more to subscribe to my youtube channel bye